we're just saying like he was icing him during the middle. Of the oh set. yeah, you're right. Or whatever. <laughs> it, it, I, I, it, like obviously we're just joking, but um, so Larry's got the me ready to roll just in case we did see the me the last time they played, right? Yes. So. Yes, we did, and I think. If we get to okay, start we're off just going to start off with that. I, yes. I agree with this. Give the people what they want. Yeah, we yeah. paid hard-earned money. It's time to see this character come into fruition. Yeah, so Larry had a personal request <laughs> to get Bomberman on the, the stream <laughs> setup switch. And, of course, 2GG delivers. The Bomberman outfit is here to stay. The people ask, the people shall receive. There you go. All right. Yeah. Oh, I think something's happening. Some, uh, we got some. I'm hearing. I'm hearing some whispers or something. Technical. Technical Whisper. issues. Anyways. Anyways. You know what? While we have this quick break, I just want to give a shout out to everyone who uh, who stopped by. If you didn't know, I had a birthday stream last Tuesday, nice. and nice, nice, it nice. was fantastic. I had an absolute blast. That was probably the most fun I've ever had streaming, and uh, it was Sick. all in part mainly because you at home stopped by. Shouted me out, said happy birthday. Let's go. Thank you. Thank you for that. This, the birthday stream was a success. The birthday stream was hype, for sure. Can't ask for anything more than that. Except Bomberman. Oh, you're right. Bomberman. <laughs> Let's get some Bomberman. Let's go. All right, so uh, I believe Larry, I'm assuming he's going to use the same set he used against uh, Dom last week. So yeah, I think so the only thing that's like pretty obscure for Larry is uh, Larry likes to use the, uh, what is it, the the, the punching neutral B, the, the rapid punch. Oh, yeah, I believe that was the one that was uh, recently buffed. Yeah, it was, it was definitely buffed. Um, I think Larry used it before anyway, um, but they increased the range of it. So yeah, that like the tipper of the punch now activates it. Right, right, right. So that's just like a one, it's just a range increase, and two, there it is. Dom gets it every time. Yeah. The return of the boomerang. You thought that was a Link setup? No, that is in fact a Richter setup. That is a Dom setup. Yeah, Dom just is able to close out some stocks Ooh. very oh. early. Oh, no. Okay, goes up and over here. Ooh, like the this. command grab. Yep, Big snatch guy. him up. And that thing's so good because if you perform it like in the middle of the platform, it's going to catch both, like standing and jumping. Yeah. And one thing I know Larry likes to do as like a parry mix-up, instead of landing with Nair, he'll land with a neutral beam. Um, on shield, like as he's as if he's coming down onto you, like with an aerial. So, see if Larry like is able to get any of those. Also, cover spot dodge as well. But right now, Dom has not taken uh, too much damage, and he is doing dishing out a lot. And just look at this stage control. Larry cannot get off the edge. Dude, oh my god! Even whenever he does get off the ledge, back in the center stage, he just quickly gets sent right back out. Yeah, it, like Dom just is pressuring you, and then the moment you feel like you can get in, shield, up you out of shield. Like, <laughs> up you out of shield, and back you go. Off with you. Yeah, oh, wait a minute, but there's the punish. Up you out of shield, extremely fast. I believe it's frame six. Correct it's me if I'm wrong. better fox up smash. Right, but the, the thing is, it doesn't have crazy amount of range. That's where it you're lasts, right? right? So, right. you know, fox up smash, be scooping. I mean, look at Bomber, man. He got little legs, man. He ain't got no true. metal legs. True, true, true. <laughs> Man, Larry's down an entire stock. This is going to be rough. Obviously, uh, Richter can just die at any given moment off stage. We'll see if Larry can create that scenario, though, because Dom control, man. Dom just knows how to control the stage so well and just keep at that max distance and really play that mid-range. He is, he is indeed a master with his chain and these projectiles. Oh, yeah. Look at this. The, the neutral be coming back as well. Oh. I mean, that's kind of what I'm... I'll be honest. This is what I'm looking for, Larry. I'm looking for these soft hit nares. And that's where he's going to look for his time for the convert. I so mean, he's not taking too much damage. But, I mean, it, it definitely starts adding up here. 91% here on Dom. Can Larry get another opening? Dom now setting up shop. Oh, catching the roll with the Eftil. Dom continuing to keep Larry away to stay out of the close range. Oh, here oh we go. what's the punish? No, no down punish. smash. I down like smash, S smash, up B, anything. Yeah, I mean, in that in that situation, you're probably looking for like the most optimal thing, but even just like a down smash to launch him off stage, get some damage, right? Like, look at that. Oh my goodness. Yeah, this down smash. got some power. <laughs> down smash for sure. He walked up and down smash. I I think uh, Brawler's down smash is definitely one of the more goofier down smashes too. Like just the like 
you're kicking and punching. Like that's so. <laughs> what what are the character kicks and punches at the same time? You know, it's, in a singular it, move. It looks even goofier with Bomberman. Yeah, true, true. <laughs> the costumes aren't helping. <laughs> oh no! You thought he was gonna pull the trigger on the up B. See, in that scenario, I feel like you kind of just delay your air dodge anyway because I, I don't know. It's hard to say. I don't know if he uh, like up B's weird because it really depends on how high in um, in the air you are because you can like alter the angle of that move so much. So yeah. I actually don't know if Larry was dead to up B there. He might it, if he was dead to up B. Like that's obviously like a okay. Well, you just have to guess, right? It's that is like a really tough 50-50 because you can either like throw out the air dodge trying to avoid the the up air that you know we may be coming out. You can throw out Nair. To, uh, if you're expecting the axe or try and get the clank and then fastball back down to the stage. So it's a really awkward 50 50 that a lot of people aren't used to being in. Yeah, yeah, for sure. And I, I, I love the coverage from Dom as well, right? Like the axe is going to be a really strong attack. It has a bit of startup. So it, it just, in terms of timing, you get that down here and you just go straight into the neutral beat. You're going to cover air dodge extremely well. And the move's just so strong. You're throwing it so high up in the air, like they're going to get KO'd extremely early. Okay, wait, so here we go. We got the character switch to Wolf. Now, uh, what, do you, what do you think about this, Charles? What do you think about this Wolf pick? I like the Wolf pick. I also like the FD pick as well. Um, I think Wolf does very well on this stage. Um, it's, just, it's just nice and open. Uh, disadvantage state is going to be great for both. Or, like, pushing advantage state is going to be great for both players here. So, wow, the grab connects. I don't know how that connected. Yeah. I thought he just, like, <laughs> he straight just up pulled it. Grabbed his leg. Get over here. Yeah, may uh, maybe he just ran out of intangibility. I know some characters can like still be in their rolling animation, but they just don't have intangibility. So like that's they unfortunate. Just get, they just get hit. That's a, that's very unfortunate. <laughs> See how Larry utilizes the shine here, gets another grab. Good damage here on Richter, and he's barely missing that uh, up air there. So now back on the ledge. Yeah, using these double jumps from ledge too to get a little bit of extra height. Continuously trying to land in center stage and then. Either cross up or pressure with back airs. Yeah, you really got to watch out for that reverse cross off stage. Too. Dom loves to set that up if uh, if the situation calls for it. Definitely can be risky, can be called out, but you know, higher risk, higher reward. You have yeah. that you know cross coming back on stage is so nice. Parry into the dash attack center stage, still not enough. The drop zone there, not enough time to set up the up smash, and man, Richter goes. Really far after that second down tilt. Oh, yeah, hitting the eject button with the down tilt, and Richter was out of there. Getting again, once again, that down tilt coming in clutch for Dom. Oh, oh, man. This is so scary. Dom has max rage here. Larry on the ledge. Has to avoid the axe, but tries to. There's so much threats happening at that point, right? Like, you can't stay on the ledge because the axe is going to hit you. Yeah, so, yeah. do you want to do a grounded option? Now, Larry has no rage. Nips with the laser, but. Still enough to get back on the stage. Larry's still just looking for one solid tilt to get the uh, KO here. I mean, a tilt, the nair, like so many different options that Larry can land to close out the stock, but the, that is, in fact, the hard part, landing any of those options. As you can see, Dom is being very dominant with his spacing. And a lot of people don't realize how heavy R Richter is. <laughs> Richter is as heavy as Samus. I believe they're around, if not the same weight, around the same weight. So. Pretty heavy character, obviously, uh, you know, the recovery is where the weakness lies, but I feel like Dom, for the most part, is able to recover, like, fairly well, uh, at least against, like, in the matchups he's been playing throughout this tournament. Yeah, I mean, I mean especially when you think about it, like, Dom, whenever he's getting thrown off stage, I think only a few times we've seen, like, someone actually exploit the bad, quote, bad recovery of Richter. Yeah, Usually he's, uh, he's able to cover his own ledge options, and then force himself to get back on stage. Yeah, and I feel like, you know, especially like the first year of Ultimate, all Richters just tried to use up B to recover, but, oh, yeah. you know, you can use the forward air and the back air to recover. Especially if you angle angle them upward too, it helps a lot, the oh. distance as well. So uh, that's why you're able to see him tether from so far away. But Larry able to finally get this up smash here uh, is now in the lead for the first time in the set. Okay, up B out of field. Here we go. Sending Larry all over the place, making him look like a ping pong ball. Yeah, but still no fuzzy dice, no KO. The up air, not enough. He had he had an earlier up air too. I don't know if there was just no tipper on that or what. Larry avoiding the ledge trap though, using the intangibility on the throw, double dash attack. Ooh. Yeah, throwing all kinds of move at that ledge too. You want direct on air dodges? Well, we got F tilts, we got down tilts. Yeah, single jab. Like we were looking clean out here. 
up and over though. Larry now has the center stage. Blast was the wrong way, that could have been a hit. Not like a ton of damage, but you know. Everything counts. Oh wow, such a high percent. Doesn't even auto combo into the second hit of down tilt there. Larry, that probably would have killed Larry, but he only gets another hit in, so it doesn't super matter. Pretty decent lead here for Larry though. Yeah, 62%, but you've seen, you've seen it, Charles. It only takes one conversion, really, to, for Dom to make up that kind of deficit. And now, Larry trying to get some reflector damage here, but Dom feels, it feels like just baiting the, uh, baiting the reflector and kind of just playing the situation after very, very well. Oh my goodness, look at this, 92%. What happened to the wolf? Spawned in at zero. Ooh, it's the all, back air. All these baits that we see from Dom. He's throwing out projectiles, forcing Larry, expecting Larry. Oh, really there was to no double. There, there was no double jump there. No oh, double jump, but, but still, Dom able to weave around Larry's nair, make it back to stage. Okay, up throw. This is so close. There's the double jump. Oh, oh the, the up air tilt. Dodge. Can Dom make it back? Here's the directional air dodge. The angled up forward air. Oh, where are you going, Larry? Where are you going? Especially if Dom starts the offstage off with a directional air dodge and doesn't get punished for it, it's not too bad, honestly. Okay, honestly, when it comes to like getting clipped by anything, getting sent away from with a, with the boomerang, not that bad of an uh, of an option. Oh. Okay, give him the slashes, yeah. the Wolverine F tilt. Yeah, the ledge trap finally pulling through for Larry's side there, barely getting uh barely barely getting that forward tilt. The ledge drop into neutral B. Uh, was the option there. I believe we saw the axe in the uh, freeze frame there. So, nonetheless, game number three, probably going to stay Wolf. Um, we'll see what the stage pick difference is here. Town and City, not that different, honestly. Like, we're going to have the platforms coming in and out. So, you know, half the time about we're going to have no platform. The other half we're going to have, you know, various platform layouts. But hmm, pretty similar to FD. Yeah, it's also a fairly wide stage. So, it it's, it's it's give a uh, give give Dom a lot of room to work with, especially when it comes to setting up his traps. Oh yeah, absolutely. Yeah, because we, we've seen like Larry kind of push Dom into the corner, you know, throughout this throughout this set. So I mean, definitely something you want to do in general against any zoner. Just don't give them any more room to fade back. <laughs> they keep fading back, right? So. Yeah, dash back, best move in the game. Yeah, dash back, best move in the game. And you can't do it when you're up against the corner. No punish there, we're getting the, the roll instead. Yeah, in terms of punishes, like getting hit by a B out of shield uh, compared to what Dom could have done, like, not too bad. Yeah. Yeah, he took like 12, that's fine. There he gets the sour nair, tries to go for the down smash, there's Ooh. the dash attack. Ooh. Run off nair. Oh no. Yeah, and, and like I was gonna say, maybe Larry could have like delayed the laser just a bit, but he picked it up with the nair anyway. You know, as long as you're setting up like, I think Larry more so was just using the blaster to get some kind of option out and then like, you know, react from there, go for the runoff aerial. But this wolf is on the hunt. He has been pressuring Dom relentlessly. Yeah, the uh, the Nair spacing has been excellent for Larry here. Like the entire second stock, Dom has honestly just been on the receiving end of Larry's aggression when it comes to like cross up, uh, trapping, his, uh, trapping his air dodges, getting like reverse grabs. Pretty much whatever Larry wanted to do, it was landing. Yeah. The forward tilt, driving the ledge. Oh, that's okay. Okay. I, I like I saw Dom jump and I was like, oh man, are you gonna be able to capitalize off of it? But the angle down back here, still enough to pick it up. But Dom has a bunch no. of damage and man. Drifting back too far. That's so unfortunate. Yeah, Victor, you're definitely not gonna make that back. But yeah, I mean just a just a mishap, right? Probably just yeah. Maybe he didn't think he burned his double jump, so he drifted back and tried to like. I'm honestly jump. hoping it's not like becoming a, a mental issue because when uh, when we saw Larry run off and like get the nair on the first lock, you know, Dom kind of looked at his controller like, what was that? And then now now an in miss input. Hello. What was that? <laughs> hello. Controller, hello. Okay, there's the holy water. Oh, nice reaction from Larry. Here's the tech chase. Another grab. Ooh, oh, too early. Too, too early. soon. Oh, is that? Nah. Yeah. Wow. Yeah. Yep, he's out of here. Dang, I, I, I like because of how I mean. Oh, it is town and city. Yeah, town and city horizontal blast zones. I believe it's like the best stage. So yeah, I mean now that I think about it, definitely not too much a su of a surprise. Right at the edge of the stage, he was like kind of even off a little bit as well, right? Like off yeah. the stage a little bit. Wolf forward tilt. Definitely closing out and sealing the, the deal there. Yeah, but now we see, of course, Dom on his counterpick going back to final destination. 
It's, I mean, it's, of course, another wide stage. We're gonna allow Dom to set up those traps, but when he, when push came to shove and Larry was on the hunt, he could smell the blood uh, all over Dom. He just was able to, again, apply so much pressure and get his combos. It's happening again. Charles, Dang. it's happening. Larry's jamming him to this song too? Oh, oh no! What? Oh no! What was that? Dang, he was cooking, man. <laughs> Frank the Targets was playing, like no, everything. Man. You know, life is good. You're playing a spacey. You All know? the firefighters. We Yay. got an oil spill right here. Dom was just like, oh, double jump, drag down there. Dude, imagine getting gimped from Richter. Oh, Feels God. bad. Feels bad, man, for sure. Oh, um, the music made it worse, I'm telling you, dude. Like, you're. Dang, you're a spacey, you're just going in on someone, break the targets. Dang, that, that is a huge momentum killer, and look at this, I believe there's no double jump. Wow, no double oh. jump needed, but who, who needs a double jump? I got Axe into F smash, and okay, talk about aggression, talk about everything going your way. That's Dom right now. That reversal of drag down Nair was everything Dom needed to bring himself back into this game. Forget game three. It's about game Ooh, four, Okay. Dom. And, and, and the crazy thing is Dom took two stocks in a minute. Yeah. Which is wild. So, you know, Dom definitely uh, doing the crazy amount of damage output, pushing that advantage state. I mean, he went. <laughs> oh, he definitely, like, turned on the Super Saiyan energy right now. He's trying to apply all the pressure, which, you know, typically we see Dom playing very trap-heavy, throwing out a lot of projectiles, but he does not need them right now. He's gone straight whip. And we are starting to see the punishes on the reflector. Larry has been utilizing the reflectors to kind of slide by some of these uh, ledge trap scenarios. But now Dom kind of just throwing out like the uh, the forward airs or the back airs angle down and just doing an incredible job of covering that. Yeah, using the, the second hit of the down tilt once again, pushing Larry off stage. And here we go. Larry air dodging center stage. Oh, he was waiting. He, he wanted Larry to get hit by the cross. He was so ready for that conversion. Oh, fast falling is a little bit too far. He wanted to escape the, the holy water before Dom was able to set up an S match. All right, so final destination uh, not working out. I mean, I don't think that was a I stage mean, it thing. It worked out pretty well for Dom. <laughs> oh, right, so wait, Dom <laughs> counterpicked. Dom counterpicked the final destination. Oh, I thought, I, thought, I thought Larry, for some reason, I thought Larry counterpicked there. So, I mean, I think they both have a game on final, right? Yeah, they do. Yeah, yeah, okay. Which, so. you know, with, especially like how dominant Larry was like you would think counterpicking to somewhere you know. I I don't think the stage was too big of an impact there. Uh, I mean Barely. obviously the I mean the Nair. <laughs> yeah. yeah. He was jamming him and then he got Nair at like 20. Like <laughs> I, I I feel like just some of like that and then Dom definitely like just turned up on the second stock. So then um, so then what is the adjustment we see from Larry? Does he not go for that scenario again? Does he not? Does he continues to save his double jump just in case? Even if he is the one lead trapping Dom, he's up by like 70, 80 percent. I, th I think the offstage can be a little cleaner from Larry. Um, I, I, I do think that even like some of these reflectors, Dom cashed out on so much damage when the uh, like Larry's going for the shine on the reflectors, right? So I feel like you definitely have to start playing around that. Dom is definitely ready for it. And then kind of go for some other options just because if Dom has to play ready for that, he's definitely not covering other options, right? Right, right, right. Okay, well, here we go. Here's the up throw, looking for the air dodge. Gets it. Only a single up air, but then takes the trade. He's, uh, these percents being mighty close between these two players. Yeah. But I, and by no means am I saying, like, Larry should have. Oh, yeah. he got it. Wow, the up air, not even the up B. I don't know which one is faster, but just for, you know, just choice. for flavor. Just for flavor, the up air, though. Dealer's choice for sure. Okay, yeah. there's going to be the up smash. You know, I honestly think that the last up smash that Larry landed on Dom should have actually killed him, but uh, the holy water actually, like, stopped him because he got right. hit by it. All right, so even... Even two stocks apiece here. Tries to go for the up tilt. I like the DI in maybe from Dom. Um, down throw into the dash attack here. Getting all okay. the good damage. Dang, that that angle. Good angle. Yeah. yeah, what was that? He threw it the, the course of the entire stage. Ooh, Larry's starting to get some of these down airs. Oh, you didn't go up smash. Maybe he thought he was just going to DI out. Maybe he could just get like a really good offstage scenario. Uh -huh. Can't blame Larry for going for that. Um, generally, sending horizontally is usually the way to go here. Okay, Larry doesn't get the edge guard there, but is able to make it back onto stage here. 
Not too much damage on Larry, but we've seen Dom just give him one advantage there. Give him it, one ledge trap and see what can happen. It, 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 the, the damage that's currently on his opponent doesn't doesn't tell the truth. doesn't tell the whole story. It's only one interaction, like you said. But at the same time, look at Larry. Oh, no double fire! Way. Oh, okay. okay, the air dodge coming in clutch for Larry. Oh, my goodness. He's not out of the doghouse just yet. My heart stopped, and Dom is still going. Look at all this. Even though the KO didn't happen, look at all this percent. Dom yeah. is going to take that. Like we were saying, damage can rack up in an instant. Invading out, punishing the reflector once again. Dom has definitely adjusted to Larry's downbeat. Yeah, I, I wonder if Larry is still buffering some of the options. You can get a shine and go into things like roll, spot dodge, and jump. Um, I'm not 100% sure if you can do it like in the air, but for sure when you're on the ground. Um, so maybe he needs to do more of that. Maybe he has been doing it, and Dom just catches it before he can even act, right? Maybe, so. maybe. You know what did land? That football kick, the punt. Dash attack from Larry, even up the stock. Ladies and gentlemen, we're in game five. One stock apiece. This is for grand. This is for uh, grand finals. Ooh, I like that up air setup right there from Larry. A bunch of damage, sixty-four percent off that one throw. Oh, he definitely wanted forward air through the platform there. Got a forward smash. Dom is holding center. Oh, but Larry misses the grab off the nair there, fading right. back. Oh, wait a minute. Yeah, he keeps he keeps hitting Dom, man. As long as he's hitting Dom, he's maintaining stage control. He's maintaining his pressure. Oh, the sour. Nair into down smash. Here we go. It's gonna be the back air. See the see the see the, see the traps. Yeah, Larry definitely. Oh, I like the way Larry just kind of weaved the needle there. Landed. There's the air dodge. Catches the landing there. A throw putting putting Dom right back into the sky. Oh, so chasing fire going to save Dom. The Nair. Oh man, this this is so close. This is last talk a piece. Anything can happen. The roll gets caught here. 144 percent. So much rage yeah, on this Richter. Oh. oh my goodness, I think there's, okay, he did get the jump, double jump back. Oh, oh my oh, goodness! But the ah! smash didn't come out! The smash didn't come out! Is this the forward hug? throw? Yeah. Oh. Ooh, Dom clutching it out there. One wow. ledge trap, that's all he needs. He just needs one ledge trap, and man, he can what? really just do so much off 